टुडे फ्रेंड्स इन आवर सीरीज ऑफ नो योर ड्रग्स वी विल टॉक अबाउट हाइड्रोकोडोन हाइड्रोकोडोन और डाईहाइड्रोकोडिनोन एज इट इज ऑल्सो ऑल्टरनेटिवली कॉल्ड इज बाय इट्स कैटेगरी अ नार्कोटिक एनालजेसिक एंड ऑल्सो अ कफ सप्रेसेंट और एन एंटी टसिव नाउ हाइड्रोकोडोन इज अ सेमी सिंथेटिक ओपियॉइड सिंथिसाइज फ्रॉम कोडीन थ्रू एन ऑर्गेनिक सिंथिस प्रोसेस नोन एज हाइड्रोजिनेशन इन विच हाइड्रोजन एटम्स आर एडेड ऑन टू द कोडीन मॉलिक्यूल now this is the chemical structure of the hydrocodone molecule which is having a free nitrogen a, a nitrogen atom with free electrons free uh, which is which is un which is the electrons are in uncombined state and when the salt is formed from this molecule which is generally a bitartrate salt these nitrogen atoms become quaternary charge and their of their lone pair of oxygen is involved in the salt formation now this free base form of hydrocodone the structure is over here so it is a an opioid drug and according to international narcotics control board data 99% of the worldwide supply of hydrocodone in 2007 was consumed in usa alone now this is a startling fact that according to an international narcotics control board data 99% of this drug whole worldwide supply in 2007 was consumed in usa alone now you can analyze the extent of demand of this analgesic in the us especially in the us and in north america or the west in general now indications include of this drug from moderate to severe pain conditions now this is generally prescribed in moderate to severe pain conditions and untoward effects or the adverse effect undesired effects of hydrocodone include mainly to the newborns which is a very uh, dangerous proposition the newborns of mothers on hydroquinone therapy or hydroquinone dosages may be physically dependent and may even exhibit respiratory depression on high doses of hydroquinone so especially the uh, newborns are adversely affected if the mothers if the pregnant mothers are high on hydroquinone dosages several birth defects may also occur if pregnant woman is on opioid therapy in early pregnancy now several birth defects may also occur if the pregnant woman is on opioid therapy in early pregnancy so this should be avoided especially in early pregnancy and pregnant women should avoid all opioids and especially hydrocodone in during their early pregnancies now hydrocodone overdoses may result in narrowed or widened pupils slow breathing and heart rates cold or blue skin excessive sleepiness loss of consciousness seizures or even death so such severe are the untoward effects and that is not enough i mean still they continue to have even more untoward effects it can be habit forming hydrocodones like all other opioids generally are all habit forming and causing further they also cause 
causing physical and psychological dependence on the drug. Now, this is also a serious uh, untoward effect that is common with all opioids and hydrocodone is not an exception to it at all. Now, what are the contraindications of hydrocodone administration that people taking alcoholics, the alcoholics and other opioids, antihistamines, antihistamines, that is anti-allergics, anti-psychotics, anti-anxiety agents or other CNS, central nervous system depressants may exhibit additive depression. So these agents or these chemicals or these drugs including alcohol and all these drugs which have been category of drugs which have been enumerated over here are contraindicated in hydrocodone therapy. Now the mechanism of action look just look at how exactly hydrocodone acts or elicits its pharmacological action. Now hydrocodone relieves pain by binding to and activating opioid receptors namely the mu opioid receptor or MOR. It mainly relieves pain by binding to and activating opioid receptors mainly the mu opioid receptor or MOR in the central nervous system or the CNS. In blood about 20 to 50 percent of hydrocodone is bound to protein now which is also a significant uh, percentage like 20 to 50 percent of the drug is bound to protein in the blood tougher prescribing rules were imposed by the US government in 2014 by changing its status from a scheduled 3 drug to a scheduled 2 drug which is very understandable and which was very correct also on the part of the US government to having imposed certain prescribing restrictions by, while removing the, this drug from schedule 3 and keeping it in schedule 2 which is a stricter prescribing restriction in keeping in mind the untoward effect which such opioids have on humans. Now for more details on hydrocodone and other drugs you can contact me at my whatsapp number which is plus nine one that is India code country code and the number is double eight four zero double eight two six one four or you can email me at Dr. Kartike Pandey at gmail.com. Thank you, friends.